picking me up. Heroes, flee the city. This time, the marshal sent substitutes to shake us down. Well, you stand-ins get one warning. Fuck off, or get fucked up. Yeah? Well, McTavish doesn't want to talk to you. And you just used up your one warning. Fuck them up, boys. <laughs> You fucks in. Fault. I don't Rangers hail as heroes. Dorsey's flee the city. Look, this time the marshal sent substitutes to shake us down. Well, you stand ins get one warning. Fuck, yeah, right. Here they come. <laughs> Oh! 
close the shop, my boys. Well, I'm not looking for a bullet in the face, so you can fuck right the hell off. Oh, wait, don't. Goons are cheap, but a good door is other principle. All right, come in. But I'm not helpless in here, I'm warning you. We can you. You then we numpty sunlanders who came all the way from Arizona to suck the patriarch's cock. But what happened to the rest of yous? Couldn't they tack the cold? Couldn't they drive on ice? <laughs> Couldn't they swim? <laughs> He had a devil. I just, uh, I just heard a bit. Uh, oh, okay. Ooh, information is that what I did? Uh, or maybe it's just some shit you heard. Like my bob bag, your flatland axe. I'm under Farm Brago's protection, so you can't touch me, pal. I mean, if you shoot me, then he's gonna. gonna. ah, what a lot of shite. This ain't fair. Everybody shits on me, everybody. Okay, okay. Looks like you got me at a disadvantage, so let's make a deal, eh? You piss flaps drop me enough to skip tune, and I'll tell you what I can. Damn the hell, I'm not going back to the stocks, no way. Fine, I'll spill your monkey desert trash. OK, yeah, I let the doses in the city, and I'm glad I did. Least I could do after the patriarch put me in the pillories. Asshole throws my bloody face off. I got a career where my nose should be. Of course I wanted some revenge, wouldn't you? I know, right? Oh, I, well, I was buying some wholesale medicine for Gadji when all of a sudden the marshal jumped out of nowhere and grabbed me. Say I'm buying me intent to sell or some shit. I try to tell him, I'm no selling it. I'm getting out of war with every purchase of an oil change at my shop, but the bar bags can't see the difference, so they drag me after the pillories. I mean, I busted for charity, I ask you. 99% sure those guys took me by and sold it themselves too. Fucking marshals, they should stay on the inside of the law. <laughs> Are you kidding me? This is a bear shot in the woods. Of course the marshals are corrupt. They work for the patriarch, don't they? And he's the most corrupt tally washer of them are. You think he's the great feather who takes care of the people of Colorado? Utter shite! He takes care of the people who take care of him. That's it. Now the rest of us peons are just here to keep the machines running. That's why I ended up working for Brego. Now he's a crook too, but he doesn't pretend he's no. No like some people I could name. the time! How'd you know that? Bloody hell, that's another thing the Patriarch owes me for my health! I didn't know that's what they were going to do. I just thought they were going to kill Buchanan. Ah, that's, that's Scottish. I'm Scottish. See, Scottish plate, Scottish uh, logo, everything Scottish. The McTavishes were the kings of Scotland once you can. Whatever 
Hey, it's Scottish. I learned from a video of Braveheart, which was right there with the Maid Scotland. It's going to be right. Because I found the tape in a burnt out car, so it could be a wee bit warped. What? No, oh, no way. Why would they think that? Mr. Bragg would not have to do with us. Nothing. What are you going to do with me? Custody, you whores! Didn't I tell you what you want to know? You fucking love it, are the same? Copy, November 1. This is Ranger HQ. Go ahead. Copy that, Team November. Arrest team from HQ is en route. Uh, Team November, come in. Yeah, I got Ms. Wong, the manager at the Sands Lux Apartments on the line. And this one might actually be something. Says she's got a tenant who might be making bombs in... Shush, 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 let me talk to them. You're leaving out important details. Uh... It's the weirdo in apartment three. He's gonna kill us all. There's all kinds of loud banging coming from his room. And he's not alone. He's got friends in there. They're planning something. I know it. Do you think I would have called you if the marshals had listened to me? They say I call too much. Goddamn lazy good-for-nothings. Maybe there was nothing going on those other times, but this one's real. I'm sure of it. Come to the Sands Lux Apartments, now! That loon is liable to blow the whole place sky high! Uh, sorry, November. Over and out. Huh? What do you mean by sorry? Would you rather freeze to death or... You're a barrel of monkeys, huh? Come on, answer the question. Hostages all right, all right. murdered by Dorsey thugs. You're gone, Listen, family confirmed you're dead. So your family saves a few bucks on the field. Maybe I'll join the march. 
assholes. I do like roughing people up. You get drummed out I a second. I loved this five. job. I'm sure they could use my help. Did you ask your wife about your uh, concerns about her? I don't want to come here. What's the rush, huh? Why don't you tell your old pal Charlie what you found out from McTavish? Well done, Red Hats. Thing is, maybe I made it sound like I could get you into the back, but I can't without Mr. Brigo say so. Go talk to him. Tell him what you found out, and I'm sure he'll be open to a deal. Ah. Uh, don't mention me, though. Thanks. So, uh, what'd you do to that poor bastard, McTavish? <laughs> Better there than in the stocks, I guess. I'm gonna head to the machine shop and clear up any mess you left, all right? Nothing but a favor between friends. You should go on upstairs and talk to Mr. Brigo. See you later, Red Hats. Oh, oh, I, I, I love dancing at this point. You don't know what you're talking about. What do you want? Can't you see we're busy yelling at each other? You're the one yelling, and if you don't stop, they're going to kick us out. <laughs> I'll kick you. Uh -oh. Trouble. Stop you, it, you, you stole don't away. Away. Right out, hold. Yes. They hate the premises. Yes. Sure, gonna get it. Ah, oh, Rangers. I get the feeling this isn't a social call. I understand you had a little talk with McTavish. And I want you to know I'm as appalled as you are that he let the Dorseys into the city. He served me well. But, well, he's always been an idiot. Now, what do you want to talk to me about? Aren't you clever? Realizing I don't mind dying so much, but I'd hate to see this place burn. Right, I'm ready. Give me the bracelets. Copy, Team November. This is Ranger HQ. What's new? Over. Copy that. Congratulations, November 1. That's a mighty big fish you brought in. Over and out. Delgado, 
Bet you thought Daisy forgot all about you. Quan, how'd you get past the guards? Are these the Rangers? Good old Daisy. Always takes care of her people. I appreciate you coming in here to bust me out. Didn't think anybody could take down Farron Brigo. <laughs> I bet you could teach the marshals a thing or two. I've been keeping an eye on Brigo for a while. He's a survivor. Likes to play both sides to make sure he always wins. After the Dorsey raid, I started asking questions about the club. Well, I guess I got too close to the truth. They grabbed me, dragged me in here and locked the door. Took my weapon and everything. Good thing you came along. Nah, they know better than to hurt a marshal. Though, after all this, I'm starting to think maybe I should have known better. And don't tell my wife, well, what are you gonna pay me to keep quiet? <laughs> Quan, always the kidder. Um, you are kidding, right? <laughs> don't worry, Delgado. Your secrets are safe with me. Will do. Hope I see you again, Rangers. You're a barrel of monkeys, huh? Oh, come on. Nice to see the city back to life, huh? Yeah, people are shopping. Here they are. That was one hell of a sneaky way to get Brigo to surrender. Round of applause for the Rangers, Marshals. I need to keep him Brigo and Ranger lockup, and I won't say I ain't disappointed. I wanted him here. But at least that shitty nightclub is shut down. Now folks will know what'll happen if they lay hands on a marshal. You're a lot keepers after my own heart. Around here, we always remember who our friends are. Now I said I'd owe you a favor if you took care of this for me and I meant it. Thing is, Delgada owes you too, big time. 
so I'm sending him over to your base to manage your armory. He'll take good care of you. Thanks again, Rangers. You ever need my help, you know where to rustle me up. <laughs>